get a good rhythm, and I think it was it was important to kind of wash that taste out of our mouth after the last three games. Um, and I thought we did. I thought we looked better, and I think that's a result of the way we practiced the last three days. The second year in particular looks, you know, like it's taken a big step in the right direction. How encouraging was, was that? Uh, very. They look great. You know, just the, their spirit, you know, how they move the ball uh, defensively. They have all the tools. Uh, I think offensively, it's just about learning each other. And they, mm -hmm. you know, to their credit, they've been coming in a little early every day. Um, in time, um, we're going over the offense um, and, and getting reps in. So that's a product, you know, in my, in my eyes, it's a product of just putting in extra work. There was um, times, obviously, uh, where it looked like Lance was, you know, new to the group. There were a couple plays where he would cut and mm -hmm. was supposed to go the other way or something like that. But did you get a sense for how willing he is to be kind of a lockdown type defender? Yeah, he, he, I think he's really embraced it. The last three days in practice, he's been great. I mean, his spirit's been great. His, the way he's um, you know accepted the challenge of being that guy for us, um, and, and his like you know, intent to learn, like his willingness to learn, is, is, uh, has been great. So. Um, he can be great for us. I mean, it's just a matter of kind of getting that, that down, like you said. I mean, it's hard when you come in with four guys and we play together for you know, it's our third year now. Um, we all just kind of know. It's just, it's just always flowing. So whoever you put in there, I feel like is going to kind of feel like the odd man out until it gets that rhythm down. Lance and, and Wes and Paul are obviously like very different options at small four. Does it change anything for the other four guys who are who have been together when they have different kind of options and different types of guys to there? Yeah, a little bit, but you know, with our offense, once they get the offense down completely, I think with our offense, it, it, it shouldn't it shouldn't feel too different. Um, mm -hmm. You know, because the ball should move. I mean, we try to move the ball a lot. And, um, you know, Paul and um, Lance and Wes are all very capable. They can all put it on the floor. Um, they can all pass. They can all score. Um, so you know, some different different levels. Um, and, you know, certain strengths are different, but I think once we get the offense down, it will all flow a little bit better. Like how, are you, in there. Me, how are you able to get to the spots against, you know, a defense that was the best in the league last year? It seemed like you were able to get to the spots you wanted to tonight. How are you able to do that? Uh, just the way we attacked, you know, offensively, how the boss was moving. Uh, you know, everybody was taking the shots they were supposed to take, and, and you know, I hit some shots. But uh, again, I think it was just kind of a product of our, our practices the last three days. I thought we had great practices. And, uh, you know, a lot of times when you have practices like that and come into a game, it, it kind of carries over. Um, uh, we kept that, that intensity. Austin was saying that with the type of talent you have on the team, everybody's going to eat. So can you talk about that? Because it seems like you guys no one missed a beat. You know what I mean? Mostly yeah, here. Mostly here. Mostly yeah. Sure. Yeah. Or DM. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you know, it's our, our thing is it's not it's not always going to be your night, um, so your night to eat, I guess. <laughs> so it, it's you know, it's, it's more about what we do as a team, and, and you know, I know people say that, but when you have a team like this with a lot of talented guys and a lot of guys that can score the ball, can make plays, it, you really have to have that that patient mindset and know that um, you know it's not every night's not going to be your night. So yeah, we are very capable of doing that, but at the same time, sometimes teams like that have to be extra cautious um, because you know everybody's kind of used to that. Thanks, thanks, Blake. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. What kind of food metaphors? <laughs> <laughs>